Hey guys, it's Sandy. Welcome back to Cute Polish. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you a cool new nail art accessory, detachable nail charms. I came across these online recently and I thought I'd give them a try for you guys. A couple are bows and a couple are furry pom-poms. <laughs> Today I'm going to be focusing on using this big fuchsia bow because it's my favorite from the bunch. So let's jump right in and see how to use it. To begin my manicure, I'm starting off with a base coat to protect my natural nails. This will help to protect my nails from staining and it will provide the perfect base for adhering nail polish. Next, I decided to do a design using the colors fuchsia and white to match the big bow that I'll be using. I wanted the bow to be the main focus, so I decided to keep the design super simple with polka dots. Something really cool about these detachable charms is that they are interchangeable. So if you have a bunch of them and would like to change them up each day, I recommend doing a design using colors or neutrals that would match them all. Oh, I also wanted to share with you guys a quick and helpful tip for doing polka dots on nails. It's important to be cleaning off your dotting tool in between dots, or at least after every few dots, or else the polish will gather up on the tip creating uneven sized polka dots as you're designing. So to quickly clean the dotting tool, you can swish it around in a cap full of acetone, and then push it into a makeup sponge. I love to do this because it's so quick and easy. Once your designing and polishing is done, it's time for the bow charm. As mentioned earlier, I'll be using this big fabric bow that has gold metal hardware and a little pearl hanging from it. On the back, you can detach the little gold piece and this will attach onto your nail. It has a magnet on it, which is how the bow stays on. To attach the bow to my nail, I'm going to be using the Kiss Salon Secrets Nail Art Glue. I love this stuff more than the regular nail glue for attaching 3D decor on my nails because it's thicker and it dries stronger. So just add a drop of the glue and then press the back piece of the bow onto the nail. One thing though, I do not recommend using tweezers for this. The metal in the tweezers will attract to the magnet and you won't be able to lift the tweezers off of it. I made this mistake here while filming, but then I just went ahead and I used my fingers for it instead. Keep the magnet secure on the nail with your fingers for about 30 seconds and then it should be fully dried within a couple minutes. As you can see, it's really on there and it won't be falling off anytime soon. Again, I love this nail art glue for 3D decor, so I'll link it down below for you guys if you're interested, along with the magnetic detachable nail art charms that I'm using here today. I was a little worried about how the manicure would look without the bow being attached to it, but it still looks pretty cool, even with just the magnet on it. I think the gold border around the magnet really helps make it look like a nail charm on its own. And now for the fun part. Just take the big bow and snap it in place. How cool is that? So simple to attach. This manicure is very bold and eye-catching and it would be perfect for parties or events. But if you'd just like to wear it as an everyday look to school too, that would be great. I'm sure you'll get a lot of attention and compliments with it. The fact that it's detachable is pretty awesome too because you can remove the bow before washing your hands or when you're sleeping and so on. You can also just snap it right on before going to a party. The bows are definitely my favorite, but there are these furry pom-pom ones too. Ever wanted to try the furry nail trend? <laughs> Now's your chance. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Click here or here to watch more awesome videos on Cute Polish and click here to subscribe if you haven't already. I love reading your comments, so please let me know if you enjoyed this video or if you have any video requests for us. Thank you guys so much for watching, take care, and I'll see you next time!